New England Heavyweight Championship. And yeah. now he's teaming with Nelson because Big Woody's been in a car accident. This is, I don't even know what to make Apparently, of all of this. Apparently the hatred, the enmity, the ill will is over. But what about those words towards Big Woody? Hey, ever since the Firestone recall, there have been a lot of accidents. Actions. Ryan Webster, the action started. Holy cow, and they are double teaming the champ here, and it does not look good for Brian Day. He prepared for a match with Big Woody and Knuckles Nelson. He did not prepare for a match with Curtis Slamdog. That's true. Uh, I don't know. Are they supposed to make legal tags, or can they just double team at will? I don't know the rules and regulations governing this. Uh, this is you your, don't your know court. the rules and regulations for crying out loud. What wrestling Call school the double did you go play. to? Look at that maneuver right there. Oh, but look at Brian Day is right back up to his feet. Look out! Double clothesline over. Oh, slam dunk over goes Knuckles Nelson, and Brian Day has cleaned house here in the opening moments of well, this now, contest. Well, now why isn't Big Woody assisting? his partners right now. Well, why would you? I mean, he's got three out, good limbs. If someone three out of four out, ain't bad. That's 75 percent, Brian Webster. If someone came out and started calling you names and shouting all kinds of obscenities at you, would you want to be quick to go help them? I don't know how I'd respond in that situation, Brian. Mm, indeed. Referee beginning the count now. He's up to three. Larry Huntley, the assigned official for this contest, and things are looking bad at the moment for Knuckles Nelson, if you'll excuse the pun, and Curtis Slamdog. Oh, wait Look a minute. Out. Look Slam at that, dog though. from behind. Ah, what a shot by Day. Look out, out of the apron. Knuckles Nelson, pay attention. And he gets a what for as well. Big high knee right into the forehead of Curtis Slam Dog. Now, can Knuckles bring in another partner? He's not faring that well with the Slam Dog. Can he bring in somebody else from the no, back? No, no, no. This is not multiple choice, Arch Kincaid. Look out! Oh, no! From always, behind. Always pick C, Brian Webster. Always pick C. Indeed. Look at this. Blatant chokehold right in front of the referee. And you know what? Look at that brotherhood across the back of the tights of Knuckles Nelson. Brotherhood of all things. The brotherhood. A, an organization started by the late legendary Boston bad boy Tony Rumble. And this guy has, has a hell of a nerve, if you ask me, with uh, coming out here with brotherhood written on the back of his bow. Oh, he man, had nothing, oh, man. absolutely nothing to do with the success of the Brotherhood. That was Tony Rumble, the Boston bad boy. May he rest in peace. And this guy, this guy Nelson, he, uh, he just has no class. He, he has, he's a nothing is what he is. Well, he clearly has less hair than the last time we saw him. Uh, Indeed, we all saw what happened uh, just a couple of short weeks ago here on Maybe this if this uh, slam dog got one of those head shavings, he'd fit in with Knuckles and Big Woody and there'd be more camaraderie. Uh, between the three. I don't know, Brian. Well, what Big do you Woody, want me to come up with? Come on. Big Woody, obviously, in a car accident, unable to compete. So Knuckles Nelson goes out and gets his former enemy, Curtis Slamdog, for a partner. It just it just doesn't make any sense. But uh, hardly anything we see on this program makes any sense. A couple of weeks ago, it was uh, Knuckles Nelson sitting in the chair of Miss Kathy, a storyteller here on Channel 12. I believe Brian Day is making reference to that right now. Uh-oh, the chant begins of Baldy, and that could only be for one thing, and that is for the not so crop top of Knuckles Nelson. Brotherhood, give me a break. Uh-oh, Knuckles Nelson wants to test the strength with Brian Day. Oh, no! Well, at and least a they're, shot wor they're working south together the as a unit right there. at least. Um, Apparently now they've got to make legal tags ins and out. I think the rules have changed since earlier in the match, Brian. You're not keeping me abreast. Look at that power, though. I'm Knuckles not keeping Nelson. you abreast. Pay attention. You're sitting right next to me. Uh-oh. Tag is made. In comes the slam dog. Curtis slam dog, ladies and gentlemen, with a stiff shot right into the chest of Brian Day. Look out. Double elbow finds its mark, and Day is down counting the lights. I think their skills have improved. They Hover. are working together cohesively as a unit at this point. Would you give them that, Brian Webster? Absolutely. Like Knuckles Nelson said when he stole the microphone, it's just a business venture. Drop kick by Slam Dog, and down goes the champ once again. Huntley certainly having his hands full in this particular title matchup, ladies and gentlemen. This one's for all the marbles, the New England Heavyweight Championship. Now, if Knuckles Nelson and 
the Curtis Slam Dog win the match, who will be declared the champion? Well, only one can be champion. If they both pin, I suppose they would be co-holders of the New England Heavyweight but Championship. But you're telling me that there can only be one. Well, that's the rules, but I suppose that if they both make the pin at the same time, the referee would have no other recourse other than to make the one, two, three count, and they would have to be co-holders of the championship. Look at this here. Now, Brian Day is clearly in better physical condition than both of these men, but if they make quick tags in and out, they may be able to wear out uh, big Brian Day well, and his cardiovascular conditioning. I mean, there's only so far, so far it can go, Brian. Webster. Well, indeed, he may be in better physical condition. He may be more muscular, but right now he's on the receiving end of a lot of punishment by slam dunk. There's a, ham, uh, a, a, a hand, sandwich. A hand spring off the, well, what can I say? I should have had lunch earlier. There's a handspring right off the uh, turnbuckles, and Slam Dog is in complete control. New York City, Hell's Kitchen. That's where Slam Dog I is think, from. I, That's what he's all about. He's going up to the second level, but and Day now to the third level. Up. Look at this. Oh, no. The champ has made his way up, and there's only one way oh, for Slam no. Dog to come, and that is all the way down. Oh, look at this. On the outside of the ring now, on the outside of the ring, Knuckles Nelson has grabbed a pool stick and Woody's trying to take it away from him. Woody just tried to take that pool stick away from Knuckles Nelson. You see, you hey, think Big Woody hey, is on the side play, of Nelson. They want to play some billiards. He's, billiards? Hey. This is professional wrestling. What is wrong with you for, oh no. Oh, a man. shot right to the throat, ladies and gentlemen. Brian Day has been rocked by that shot right by that pool stick by Knuckles Nelson. The referee didn't see a thing. He was too busy arguing with Big Woody. Oh my God, one, two, three. You really got him with that shot, Brian. We got a new champion. We got a new champion. We got. What are you thinking of that now? We got. What are you thinking of that? Knuckles was uh, very animated, but Brian Day does not look Ladies well. And gentlemen, the winner of this contest and new New England heavyweight champion.